Then I couldn't look at records, though. No, <laughs> so busy with algae. Yeah. No, I mean, I'd have to carry them. Right. I wouldn't be able to look. It is. That's a Brunswick, yeah. Wine and Healy. Adorable. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Hi, baby. He's wagging his tail. Hi, Ruby. Hello. This is the nipper. The nipper, baby. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Here we are at the preliminary parking lot swap meet. Raymond is way down beyond. I just went back to the car to put a something in there that Steve Madera gave me and something, a, a nipper, a really cool nipper that I bought from him. An unusual plastic nipper from the 70s, I think he said, early 70s. So, there we go. I mean, the move alone, just the moving company is going to cost us six grand to move down. Like, what we're going to do is What's the title? Because I have so many. Baptize me. And after a while, 80 bucks. Mm -mm. <laughs> Incredible. Amazing. And there was a cotton pickers over here that just, oh my gosh. It's so <laughs> Hey. We'll hang out with uh, Steve until uh, when he comes back to his truck. He's not there. This is such a great show, right? So much fun. Hi everybody and happy Saturday. Here we are again. Tink and Raymond T. Vinyl. Yay! Hi everyone. <laughs> and today <laughs> was the Antique Photograph Show uh, preliminary parking lot swap meet and uh, we went there early this morning 
and just had a great time. Weather so. cooperated. It was really, really warm. Really and warm. I loved it. It was I loved beautiful. It. Yeah, we saw a lot of old friends and just really, really fun. Yeah. Didn't seem as many dealers this no. time. No. Well, there was a lot of dealers. The same amount of dealers, I think, but less record dealers, Yeah, maybe? less records. Yeah, and more photos and yeah. pieces and, and pieces, things like parts. that. Yeah, yeah, parts. But it was great. Yeah. Anyway, we just always love it. So... Uh, we also went to that beautiful, um, we sat on that porch, that beautiful old 1700s restaurant in Fairlawn today. Yes. You saw that in the beginning of this video. And we also put a lot of footage of the parking lot show out there, which is really, really fun. Yeah, there were some really cool things. <laughs> yeah, if you don't get to go to that show, uh, you can relive it through those those videos that we posted. I strongly recommend making a pilgrimage to it, though. Oh, yeah. The stuff is I amazing. Look, look how far Raymond comes to go to this show, yeah. right? There's well worth it. Well worth it, definitely. I'm excited for tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow's <laughs> the, the show proper. And, uh, and I still have money left. <laughs> it's amazing that we have money left, isn't it? I know. But we do. So we will go there tomorrow. Yes. Of course. All right. So we're going to show what we got today uh, from a few places. We went there. We went to Sound Exchange. We went to a Salvation Army. A really old one. A really old, old school. Old school. 29 cents an, an a LP. Record. Just wow. 45s too. 45s too? 20 yeah, because I bought 145. 29, 29 cents. cents. We were like, what? How is that even possible? It was it was really old school. <laughs> it was. It sent me back to the 80s. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Old school uh, thrifting. For I sure. loved it. <laughs> so. Do you want to go first? I'll go first. I'll show okay. what Steve Madera gave me, the gifties that he gave me. He gave me this great blow mold Santa. Look at him. <laughs> and Santa is holding biohazard tape. Also a gift from Steve Madera. Isn't that great? That's for my Halloween decor. He said that biohazard tape. But I think Santa looks good holding it like that. It's <laughs> really fun. You know, I love my blow mold stuff. Yeah, also, he's really beautiful. Yeah, he's beautiful. And look how the lights are shining. Yeah, he's glowing. Him. Yeah, Look he kind of is. He's, he is glowing a little bit, isn't he? <laughs> really beautiful. His face is painted totally different from the rest of them, which is yeah. kind of weird and cool. Uh, also from Steve, I got this beautiful 70s nipper. I love that. He is like heavy duty, hard plastic. And he is just so cute. I love him. Yeah, I still need to add a nipper to my collection. I don't have a nipper yet. Maybe you tomorrow. Will. Yeah, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> you will. I keep looking. That was so fun. Yeah, He's that beautiful. was a really beautiful score. Um, Raymond found something amazing at the Antique Phone Graph Show. Something really cool. Do you want to show us that, Ray? <laughs> I found a Jeanette Christmas greeting. Um, let me see if I can read this. Um, Always Christmas, narrated by Wilbur D. Nesbitt. And we listened to this, and it is it's incredible. It's fabulous really... condition. I don't know if you can see it, but Wilbur's name is etched into the. It's actually elder. signed. It's like signed in etching by Wilbur. On the record, so it's really cool. And then the flip is just a traditional song, you know, Silent Night, Holy Night. Not bad. We listened to it. It oh, was really good. Oh, it was good. pretty. Old time Christmas music. I love really I just really do. Yeah, I was excited. I've always wanted to put one of these in my collection. So, And I looked it up on um, Wikipedia. There was a series of ten of these, which I never knew. And they had their uh, a special sleeve. Yeah. Is this, right. Right. Very cool. Christmas sleeve on them. Very, so very, very, cool. very cool. Do you want me to share my other one? Yeah, sure. Okay, Mark. Oh. Yeah. I had I hesitated and hesitated and I just couldn't say no. Could not pass this by. No no no. On uh, Peacock Records, Hound Dog, Willie Mae, Big Mama Thornton. This is the original. You and, want this, not Elvis. Uh, right, exactly. <laughs> and we listened to that. It is killer. And we were blown away. <laughs> just a beautiful thing. Really pretty decent condition. Um, I didn't pay too much. No, it was, it was a really good price. I, right. I thought I thought it was a good price. And the dealer that. told me this was He's upgraded his copy three times, and this was his second upgrade. Right. So, 
And Amazing. And, you, know, and you never see the record. You never, you never see it. You never see it. And I just, I kept pulling it out and putting it back and pulling it out. And I'm like, I just have to yeah. have this. Yeah. I'm <laughs> so, glad. I'm glad you got I'm that. I'm glad I got it too. <laughs> I'm going to whip through what I got at the uh, Oh, she Nancy got some Cutter amazing show. stuff. I got some good stuff, but there's there's quite a few. So let's do this fast. Uh, Save a Little Dram for Me, Burt Williams on Columbia. Beautiful Columbia. This was so fun when we listened to it, right? I didn't know what a dram was. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a very Prohibition era song. So that was really For fun. those of you like me that don't know what a dram is, it's a drink. <laughs> it's a, it's a like shot. a shot. Right, right. <laughs> Uh, Victor Batwing, we have Ross's Juju Man by Blackface, Eddie Ross. Really good. Very fun. <laughs> uh, on Janet, we got It Came Upon a Midnight Clear by the Janet Mill Quartet. Beautiful old Christmas, which was beautiful when we listened to it. Yeah, I enjoyed that. Victor Scroll, we have uh, It All Belongs to Me by the great, great Johnny Marvin. One of my very favorites. Classic One of my 20s. favorite crooners. Yep. Yep. On the Fortune <laughs> label, we got The Tattooed Lady by Johnny White and his Rhythm Riders. Tattooed Lady, you know, I always collect it. I have a lot of different versions, and this is a totally different version. Yeah, it was. So we had fun with that. Yeah, he was surprised by the ending. Yeah. What state did it end in? He said Indiana. Indiana. And the other one says Kentucky. <laughs> so very fun. I guess wherever the singer is from, they insert that, Maybe, you know, or... whatever. <laughs> Victor Batwing, Tomboy Blues, The Duncan Sisters. This was one of Killer. my favorite things of the day. It was outrageous. Really, really unusual good. voices. Very, very 20s. Very, very fun. <laughs> uh, we got Good Woman's Blues by um, Rosa Henderson. Beautiful stuff. I really enjoyed that one, On um, Victor Batwing. Beautiful. No, yeah, we really liked that uh -huh. one. On the perfect label, we got Cigarettes, Cigars by the one and only Ruth Edding. <laughs> Beautiful, red perfect, just gorgeous. Very fun. Lovely thing. One of my favorite things of oh, the this day. Was great. <laughs> Thunderstorm Blues by Maggie Jones on a Columbia Flag label. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful early, early. I actually blues. learned from Tink on this one. I didn't know blues were on this label by Columbia, so now I know to look for those. Right, when you see Columbia flag, the early Columbia flag, you know it's good early blues. Definitely. If it's on that label. Yeah, I have to watch. Um, this, oh, we did, we did this yeah, the other yesterday. day. I'm sorry, that was still in the pile. Little we were Jack listening Frost. to records yeah. earlier. <laughs> yeah, we listened and I had to, never heard that song. <laughs> well, we listened to all these. This one is uh, The Devil Song by Ed McConnell. This was a great record. Yeah. Really fun, right? Yeah, I enjoyed really it too. So those are the 78s I got over there, as well as the beautiful Nipper and the gifties from uh, Steve Madeira. And uh, he also, of course, gave me a creepy clown, and he's right here on my top hat. Right here. Love him so much. So fun. So fun. Steve always gives me a creepy clown. And I have to say that Steve does have some of the um, most amazing uh, stuff. Yeah, you know? he's definitely one of the top dealers. Yeah, absolutely. And his quality. His stuff is high. It's high. High-end quality high stuff. High-end, rare. Some of the most unique record brushes we've yes. ever seen right uh, yeah that merry christmas one yeah that he has. Uh, we oh, wanted that's it. so bad so mu oh, so it's expensive but it's very expensive i think it's like 125 yeah and, yeah but boy is it sweet <laughs> it really is really great all right we went to the what's it called the Salvation Army. And Salvation Army. That was in, the 29 cent records. Right, in Pompton. And we found some great records. So um, I got Cha Cha's for Dancing, Montenegro. Oh, Montenegro. Hugo, Hugo Montenegro. Great stuff. Beautiful. And amazing shape. And this is a really must good have shape. for Space Age pop uh, collectors. And this yeah, is in beautiful. Never shape. pass up a good Cha Cha record. <laughs> and, or a good Montenegro. Right. Uh, yeah, really. Right. Um, I was really surprised by this. I just pulled it out and I was like, okay, it's going to be trash. It always is. Dion, Run, ar run Around Sue mm -hmm. on Laura. Beautiful shape. I Lori was Records. Shocked. I mean, it was really beautiful. I hope you can see that. 29 cents. Mm. Oh, I can't wait to hear it. 29 cents for a record today. Where do you get that? Yeah. You never do. Very fantastic. And then this really weird 45, it's called Gypsy Lady. 
by Gloria Mann, orchestra conducted by Sid Bass on Sound Records. That sounds really yeah, fun. Yeah, that sounds really fun. And the flip is A Teenager Prayer. And Terry used to own this. Thank you, Terry. <laughs> Wait till you see the Ventures record I got and all the writing on the back. Okay. But the record was so clean and, and I had to, you know, just had, it's so funny. Wait till you see the writing. When we went to yeah, the Salvation right. Army, they gave us these beautiful bags. Orangey. Record bags. I mean, they're Halloween. perfect. Right. They have, I don't know, some kind of advertising on, but the orange was so Halloween and the LPs fit in them perfectly. Oh, yeah, they're really they're cloth. durable. Yeah. And we asked the lady about it. She goes, someone donated 600 of these. <laughs> right, she goes, so just we have to get rid of them. That's really funny. I'm like, yeah, you're not going to be able to sell those. She goes, no, no. So. no way. No but no, Tika and I were so pleased. That, <laughs> that, right, because they were record bags. Better than the plastic bags. They were perfect. Yeah. They were so good. Cool. <laughs> so, in there, in that Salvation Army, I got these. These are so fun. These are bookmarks. And they have s Halloween safety tips. <laughs> they tell you what to do. Dress in bright colors. Do not talk to strangers. Mm -hmm. Use a flashlight or blinking pin Check at night. Check your candy. <laughs> Look both ways before crossing the street. Eat a good meal prior to Halloween events. Because oh. you don't want to gorge on candy. But they're so cute and so fun. <laughs> and there's 12 of them in there, so I'll be, give, I'll be giving you one. It, well, if you get any trick-or-treaters, you can put one in their bag. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <kidding. laughs> she didn't seem to like that idea. <laughs> I don't, I'm not giving her a trick-or-treater. All right, we got Home Nocturne by the Viscounts. Beautiful stuff. Look at that record. That's oh really God. cool. The Fabulous Ventures. This is a great Ventures. And over here, okay, here it is. It's, it's in beautiful shape. But look how much writing is on the back. I was like, what the hell was wrong with this person? Look. Blue, Blue Monday. Monday. La la. I mean, crazy. Someone was really bored. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All over the back. And they circled but, Fugitive on the front. Yeah, and it says sharpest hmm. okay and then it says on raven blue it says the best all right so whatever <laughs> but the vents this is a great ventures record perfect condition bad bad cover but perfect condition <laughs> raymond found this one for me and i this one i don't have and i love this band this is the swingle singers going baroque they're cool they are so much fun this band and I got this beautiful Everything You See Is Me Rasa. Beautiful. Awesome. New I didn't age see you stuff. pick that one up. Yeah, beautiful stuff. Really cool. Uh, the most popular guitar, Chet Atkins, one of my all time favorite guitar instrumentalists, Chet Atkins. He is amazing. His Christmas record is one of the best yeah, there is. I, I've had that for years. I love that album. Very pretty. After the, uh, oh, I did get something else at the Antique Phonograph Show, and I forgot to show you, because it's very, very cool. And this is from Joe, my friend Joe. Uh, we got most, I got most of my records from Joe. And he gave me this beautiful old Pathé plate. I'm going to get closer to you for this. This beautiful old Pathé plate. And what this uh, signifies is the damage that a storm like Hurricane Sandy does to metal and phonographs and things like that. He had a box of all that remained of what he had in his basement when Sandy hit. And you can see the damage on that. Isn't that That's why heartbreaking? Would, yes, it is. So, but very a, cool. Really cool thing. A cool thing to have a remnant of Sandy and the power of nature, right? Yes. Okay, we stopped in Sound Exchange, and I got this beautiful... Yeah. Oh, my God. I don't know if you can see it. Probably not. It's really awesome. Do you see this 45 adapter? It's made out of a record, but it's made out of a splatter vinyl. It is beautiful. I love it yeah, so much. Yeah, <laughs> that was neat. And I got Jello Biafra, uh, The Audacity of Hype. Beautiful. It was in my watch eBay watch list for a long time. And really? He had it up there. So Very cool. And I got uh, one of my favorites of all time, Little Steven, doing Trail of Broken Tears, a 12-inch single. Rock on. And what a great cover this is, because Little Steven is 
So cool. So yeah. amazing. And if you have Sirius XM, little Steven has little Steven's Underground on Sirius XM, and he plays very obscure music. And Killer Garage Records. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, because you've played that for me before, and I'm yeah, like, oh, he, he knows. That? What he, is that? This guy knows his music, and look how great that cover is. Yeah, pretty cool. So amazing. And uh, we went to the dollar store for a minute, for a hot <laughs> minute, <laughs> to buy, you know, chips and snacks and junk. And I bought this little ghost to put in my refrigerator so that every time you open the door for a beer, he will go off like this, drives Raymond crazy. <laughs> so I can't sneak a bear in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> right. Look at that. <laughs> It's it's, gonna, he'll probably scare some people, but you know what? Put him inside the fridge. He's motion activated with this little thing in the front. <laughs> yes. So when you go in to get a beer, he goes off. It's really, <laughs> really, really fun. I love that. Crazy. Yeah, it's <laughs> crazy. <laughs> it is so crazy. <laughs> so what's our fortune today? Oh. Our fate. Let's see what our fate is. Oh no. <laughs> How are we going to do at the record show? Yay! Treats will be ours. That means it's going to be a good record show day. A Helen a record uh, <laughs> show day. That's awesome. Wonderful. Oh, we got the first good fate ever. Ever. <laughs> right. We're out of that thing. <laughs> ever. Oh my god. Because <laughs> we've done it like four or five times. It's not and been it's, nice. <laughs> no, it hasn't been nice to us. <laughs> so I think that is it, guys. Right? Anything else? We went to that beautiful restaurant. Like I said, we yeah, had a couple of beers. Yeah, kind of relax this this afternoon. This afternoon and after and after lunch, after late lunch, we did relax. Yeah. But the wind started whipping up. I think a storm's rolling in. Hurricane Nate, welcome. Hurricane Nate's on the way. <laughs> We're, yeah. Working its way up. Mm -hmm. so. That's all right. We had a beautiful day for today, yeah, and that's what we awesome. care about because that's an outdoor show. Tomorrow, everything's indoors. So if it rains, it's not right. a big deal. Right. Oh, I'm excited. I can't wait to go. I know I can't either. It's always I know. so amazing. The, the, the stuff, the antiques that you see. Oh. And every and you're walking through the place, and every so often a vendor will be playing a Something. prank player, and right. it just and it just stops you in your tracks. You know, it's yeah, really beautiful. Yeah, it's really magical. So anyway, I want to say hi to Steve Madeira. I want to say hi to Joe, and all of our buddies at the uh, Antique Photograph Show. Can't wait to see you tomorrow. And again, if you see us. You know us, you watch us, come up and say hi. Yeah, we want to see you. Yeah, I would love to meet you. So, play a record today. <laughs> Have a magical, mystical, musical Saturday. I'll talk to you all very soon. Bye. Bye. <laughs>